Hey, good morning. This is Jim from Umoto Motorized Bicycles, Tucson, Arizona. Today is June the 18th, 2013, and we're here to introduce the Umoto's second generation four stroke motorized bicycle. Okay, the features of this motorized bicycle includes a Skyhawk 4G T belt drive 49cc motorized system. Okay, the motor is a Hoshwing four cycle uh, with a 49cc displacement. It has a no load RPM at 8500 and the cooling with forced air. The displacement bore and stroke is 41.8 and 35.8. The power output is 1.2 kilowatts at 6800 RPMs. The torque is 2.0 Newton meters at 4500 RPMs. The engine's net weight is 5.2 kilograms. The, motor's feature, the motor features a 100 tooth solid flywheel with a 12 tooth freewheel sprocket with a centrifugal clutch. The transmission consists of a T-belt or a timing belt drive. Okay. Their operation has advantages over the solid gearbox transmission found in other four-stroke motorized systems. T-belt drives are quieter and can last for hundreds of thousands of miles. This high-quality four-stroke Washen engine gets 150 miles per gallon with a top speed of about 35 miles per hour and has a fuel mileage of 150 miles per gallon. The bicycle is a steel frame, single-speed beach cruiser with a steel fork. It has front and rear linear and hand brake systems along with a rear coaster brake for optimal control. The bike has heavy duty thorn resistant tubes for tire protection. The starting mechanism for this motorized bicycle is a simple pearl starter which is on the side over here. There's an adjustable choke and idling screw to configure the motor's performance settings which is down above the uh, carburetor. Since the bicycle has a centrifugal clutch, there's no need for a manual hand clutch to engage the motor. Simply pulling the throttle allows for acceleration. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and demonstrate the performance of this four-stroke motorized bicycle with a test run down the street. My friend Ernesto has been gracious enough to go ahead and help me out with this. He's gonna go ahead and ride. We're gonna go watch him. Okay, and there's a simple kill switch mechanism that shuts off the bike, just like that. So, if you're interested in this kind of bike or any other kind of motorized uh, bicycle system, come check us out at 
facebook.com slash umotobikes. Thank you very much.